guys! Welcome to my Madis Karate Tips channel! I am Bujoy and welcome to my world! In this video tutorial, I will guide you on how to use Gcash apps when cashing in your Gcash wallet. So to all my discarding money kids down out there, this is my Madis Karate Tips for today on how to avoid the 1% good business fee. So let me ask you first, usually bukod sa banking transfer, saan ba kayo nagpapakash in? So today, isa-isahin natin kung saan at anong mga business center partners ang may 1% convenience fee and without convenience fee. So aminin natin guys na kapag about cash in, unang-unang option natin ay ang malapit na tindahan na nagpapakash in or cash out without considering na sayang ang 2% or more convenience fee dahil nasa isip natin na less effort, sayang ang pamasahe, at syempre ay pandemic ngayon at baka magka-COVID pa tayo sa labas. So second option is ang 7-Eleven. Usually dito talaga ang takbuhan natin in any payment like bills and transfer money like GCash. So, this video is depend to your reasons and personal purposes. If malaki ang cash-in or cash-out mo, mas advisable na pumunta sa malapit na business center partners na walang convenience fee. Like SM Supermalls, Generica, Ministop, Alpamart, at Robinson. But please take note that if you are loading a huge amount, there are charges. For Gcash, there is a 2% charge that will be deducted from your account for cash-in transaction 8,000 off. So, here are the steps on how to cash in your G Wallet without additional convenience fee or service fee. So, let's begin. So, open your Gcash account and log in using your MPIN. And just a friendly reminder, never share your MPIN or OTP with anyone. So, the step 1 is click the cash in. And then the step 2, click the view all. And the step 3, stop the generate barcode button above. And then the step 4, enter or input the desired amount you want to cash in in your mobile wallet apps. And then step 5, so here are the barcode and you need to copy or screenshot the barcode so that you can show of those codes to the cashier of any participating merchant to cash in. And just take note that the barcode has a validation and the validity lasts in 2 hours only. One of the mga discarding market tips is kung malapit kayo sa SM at magbabay din naman kayo ng mga bills, pwede nyo nang isabay ang pag-cash in sa information area. Need mo lang pila pa yung form at i-inform ang cashier about sa cash in at ipakita ang unique barcode. Guys, there's a lot of ways on how to cash in over the counter, through Picos machine, online banks, global partners, and remittance. So yun guys, so depends on you kung saan ka magpapa cash in. So syempre, dahil matidiscarding marikit tayo and gusto nating makatipid at makasave kahit papano, dun tayo sa so over the counter na alam nating 0% convenience fee at no service charge. Pwede ka naman mag-online banks at hassle-free, pero tandaan natin na ito ay my service charge. Kung satisfy kayo sa current cash-in nyo, i-share nyo sa amin kung saan ba kayo current na nagpapa-cash in and cash out, at i-share nyo sa amin kung ano na yung mga tips and ano-ano mga na-experience nyo about your e-wallet mobiles apps. So that's it for this video and I hope that I can help someone out there. And for any questions or inquiry at my video was not be able to cover, please leave down comment below and I will try my best to answer them. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my video for content like this in the future. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon next. Bye!